All right, hello everyone. So this is day five. This is our last day of our, our training program for a, for session one, levels one and two T-Rex program. Um, so today I'm kind of going to be going over what it would look like with a an exam, a skills assessment for these levels at the end of the two weeks. So usually this is the day where our swim instructors would go, okay guys, we're getting in the water and seeing if you can do this to pass the level. So if you can exhibit these skills, um, try to go to a beach, a pool, somewhere to actually practice these skills in the water and see if you'll be able to do them. So <clears throat> first we're gonna have our safety topic, which is look before you leap. If you guys know what this means, um, so usually when we jump into water, we really want to be able to see the bottom. If we can't see the bottom, it is unsafe to jump because we don't know if there's rocks or something that could hurt us under the water. So really make sure you're looking over the edge to see if it's too, maybe it's too shallow or if we're jumping on a friend, we don't want to be doing that either. All right, so what a common assessment would look like for this level is we'd be entering the water by stepping in or jumping in um, somewhere we, we can touch just really showing that we have listened and learned how to get into the water. This is very important to get into the water safely um, as we have we will do this a lot with getting into pools, getting into our bathtubs, um, anything like that. So now that um, we're in the water, if we're in about shoulder length water, um, this is where we'd start the assessment. So we would practice our front crawl with our combined leg and arm movements and go about five strokes out, five strokes back. So five strokes out would be our front, five strokes back would be our back crawl. And you would have passed that, uh, that assessment. And this is actually all one skill. So the skill would be to jump, swim, turn around, swim back, crawl back to the wall. And if you can exhibit doing that, then that is perfect. It will be about three to five lengths down and back. So if you can practice this in a pool or a, at a beach, um, that would be awesome. So next is our kind of our streamlined front glides, which um, we talked about earlier. So with our front glides, um, so our goal is to, we really want to see those arms squeezing the head. And if you push off, push off the wall, and then when you get to the other wall, push off backwards and show us you can really glide on that back glide too. So that really shows us um, the glides. And then we also like to see for one or two lengths, if you can try to exhibit that front, the breaststroke and the elementary backstroke with the breathing. So with our breaststroke, we wanna see we go down, come up with the breath, go down, come up with the breath. And after that, um, what we like to do is see the treading water movements. So this means treading water for like maybe 10 seconds, really just starting to get that arm and leg movement going is very important um, to being able to move on from this level. So I hope you guys have learned a little bit um, about how we do um, an assessment for this. So maybe try this assessment at home. Uh, this is what I like you guys to do. So go through these. Um, you can keep going through them, maybe replay some of the videos and look what I've been teaching you and try to perfect these. And then put that sticker there and I'm gonna talk about um, talk about our review in the next video. Congratulations, you guys.